Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Zodiac. I am your host, Melee Wizard, and I really have no idea what the heck I'm doing. I explored all the way through Leo again, at least the, the areas that I could get to, and there was really nothing new that I could do at this point. So I have pretty much have no recourse but to just explore things and see what I find. I did remember there was one thing here in Ares that I could get now. And I already scouted out what this is. And it is... it's not a major thing, but it is a thing that I want. It's only a missile upgrade, but it's better than nothing. I don't think there's much else that I can do as of now, at least not in Ares. But I think there are a few places scattered about that I can do now, and I'm probably going to have to do a lot of editing in for this part just because I'm gonna be traveling between areas probably a good bit unless until I find something that will trigger the plot I guess so I guess I'll see you guys then This is actually something I couldn't have done, couldn't have gotten to before now anyway. And it's still not something I can do. Hmm. Okay. That is good to know. Alrighty. I should be able to get into there now, shouldn't I? Aha! And it's another terminal. Well, great. It's information, but I can't get that information yet. Darn it. Can I? Yes, I can get here. Good. So that's more missiles for me. So it feels like, just from the way the map's laid out, it feels like there should be something beyond here. But that appears to not be the case, at least for the moment. And there's nothing that way either. Alright. Okay, 
So there is a. I have a destination here in Gemini. And it's a place I haven't been to yet. That is good, but there's one thing that I want to do first. Alright, now this time... There we go. Is this another terminal? No. It's a power upgrade. Haha. -ha. Darn right. Okay, that was definitely worth the effort. Uh, but now... Now, 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 now. Um... There's actually two different areas that I could go to right now, I think. Now it's just a matter of which way do I think leads to progress. Because I am not entirely sure. Because there was the one secret area that I couldn't explore in because I apparently needed the double jump. Plus there's the one up here. Uh, hmm. uh, you know, I'll try this way first. Because this one seems like the less obvious. Yeah, the less obvious area that I might need to go to. Oh. I'm still wondering if there's some way to destroy that thing. I am not entirely sure. Uh, or any of these things that... Any of these things that pop up. Uh, Alright, so yes, it does look like I can progress from here. Now just a matter of what can I do from here because all the information terminals are down. Uh... Okay, and... I am... This stuff reminds me of... There's one spot in Scorpio that I probably could get to at this point. I didn't think about that until just now. Because it requires a jump similar to this one. Ah, oh, jeez, another terminal? Oh, dear. So this worries me. Ooh, energy upgrade. Well, hey, in that case, I'm kind of glad that I fell down there, because that means I know that that thing exists now. Oh, jeez. Well, that's a quick way to... Ooh, what the heck is that? Did I just get Wi-Fi or something? Well done, Guardian. With this advanced scanner, you can use the enemy system as an antenna and still communicate with us. The scanner should also display the coordinates corresponding to the, corresponding to the effect had by a switch if you're in the same room as that switch. Oh, that is nice. 
Our attack caused minimal damage. The enemy still has manual control of some of its fleet and anti-ship weapons. But the nuclear strike from Earth is inbound and will be here in a matter of days. You should go to the enemy's engine room next and destroy the primary generator. Without that, they won't be able to maneuver even if they get the computer back online. The nuclear strike will then ensure the asteroid is pushed away from the home planet and we will have won. Our, necessary, our research data suggests there is a way to access the engineering section in Taurus from the Gemini Zone. Go quickly, Guardian. Okay. Huh. Are these things still down? Nope. I have access to them now. Dig Team Beta Notes. The frequent migrations of alien life forms to Gemini are very problematic. This is the best place to access the engineering section in Taurus and to install the thermogenerator. In difference, the difference in temperature between the volcanic Taurus, hell, that sounds lovely, and the dark side of the asteroid on Gemini is perfect to power all our energy needs. Recommend sealing the passage to Taurus using the switch hidden in Gemini coordinates 0B. I was on my way to do that before to prevent aliens from spreading further. Uh, I see where my health is at, so I'm going to go ahead and get that squared away. Huh. So, I think I'm going to... Well, there's at least a couple information terminals like this one, I believe. Might as well see what all these do. From the office of Representative Horus to Dr. Margaret Moe, xenobiologist. Subject, seizure of asteroid Zodiac. Ooh. Dr. Moe, I appreciate the time you took to write to me, and I understand your anger at losing this important scientific discovery. But the matter is out of our hands. The military commanders of the Alliance are in charge of basically everything while the war goes on. New Eden cannot do much to help you. You have already provided us with so much data on the alien life forms, maybe we can get by without the original samples. You also have my promise that we will seek just compensation after the war is over. And I think... I think I'm gonna go back to... Uh, Ares after this is done, and at the end I'll... As kind of a... Epilogue, something or other, I don't know. I'll... I'll put in what that terminal says, since I have access to that one now. Okay. And there's also this door here. And also, it turns out that if you destroy the thing before it spawns out of its egg, the egg stays. Uh, ooh! Wow, another power upgrade. Well, dang! Certainly... Not in any danger of having a weak weapon at this point. Oh dear. But thankfully, these doors serve as automatic checkpoints. And I am taking full advantage of it. Uh, yeah, I don't think there were any other... Uh, any other terminals that I hadn't read yet. Uh, might as well see... Ooh. Feels like I should be able to get up there. Although... Huh. Hmm. 
Eh, you know what? The switch is more important right now. And what does this terminal say? From, to, from Ferris to Captain Zhivago, subject Ice Beam. Aha! Sir, we did as you asked. We now have a way to flash freeze the alien life forms for transport and storage. We will store the frozen specimens in the Libra Zone so that they will stay frozen and out of the way. Some of our crew are cur curious why we are being asked to do this, though. I know you and Dr. Mo have made strides in the Zodiac weapon program, but we do not see why we need to keep this part of the project a secret from Dr. Mo or how it relates to the mission. What should I tell my crewmates? Okay, so there's a thing in Libra. Huh. Okay, so... Whew, okay. Oh, right, I'm in zero column, which... Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Hmm. Yeah, I am going to wait for my energy to come back, because this, re this looks like a dashing double jump situation here. Wait, didn't it say the switch was in 0B? Oh dear. <laughs> Save myself from death there. Yeah, didn't it? I thought the thing said it was 0B, or maybe I misread that as 08. That makes a bit more sense, perhaps. Oh dear. Dang it! Oh! Okay, I'm kind of glad I fell on that one. And now I see the effect that, uh... Ay, these enemies are becoming... Very much a pain. Oh wait, there was a switch down here, duh. And that opened the door to 4B. Aha! Alright, that's good to know. Although... Alright, since that seems to be the only way there. Uh, dang it. Okay. Dang it. Oh dear. Mm. Lovely, lovely platforming segments all over again. And it's basically forcing me to have to learn every little intricacy of my current abilities, huh? 
Uh, I'm thinking. I'm thinking I uh, did the wrong thing there. There, was that so hard? Any Whoa, 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 whoa. Or maybe that's not the best. Am I seriously going to die here? Yes, I am seriously going to die here. Oh my goodness, how the heck am I supposed to get there? Especially when I have all of these enemies about, and I can't... Ay, 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 you know what? That's actually becoming a little bit more trouble than it's worth. So I feel now inclined to see what this is. Taurus. Okay. Ooh, there's this door. And a heart con heart container that I can't afford. And will not be able to afford for some time. That opened the door to 7D? That opened the gym that opened the Zodiac weapon door. Hmm. I see you there, missile upgrade. Haha. -ha. Well, that was sneaky. So, I've definitely got some other places that I can go to now. Starting here in Taurus, but I think there's still a couple other places that I can go in Gemini. Like, there's that switch up there, or whatever the thing is up there, that I definitely want to see what that is. And there's also the uh, Gemini boss room. I definitely want to see what that weapon's like, so I guess until next time, this is Melee Wizard, and have a nice day!